Okay, this is an 07 GMC, and it was running great, and then all of a sudden I had that electrical problem where all the things started freaking out. The door locks were going, the airbag light was going on and off, um, the fuel pump seemed to be having problems because I had to lose acceleration. It was kind of scary as you're driving down the road, but anyway, um, I looked online and there was a few people who had had, a lot of people had had this before, um, but I couldn't at first find out what the problem was. So I took up the GMD, GMC dealership and they looked at the computer codes and it said that the ignition switch was bad, so they replaced that. And they said, oh, no problem, you're good to go. Well, I started having the problem again and I looked on YouTube and there was a video for it and this guy had an older one and there was a, a wire leading off to it of it that needed to be replaced and it was, a, it was basically a ground wire to the body. And, but since it was a different year, it didn't, it wasn't easy to translate. So what I ended up doing after some trial and error was I went through every lead that went from the battery to the engine and to you know various electrical that I could find. And I'll show, I'll point those out, and I cleaned them up really good with a wire brush. So here's the positive lead. I took both of the those off, both the negative and positive, cleaned them all up, and then I followed it down. And this goes to the mega amp fuse. And if you look online, there's a a service bulletin that sometimes the the mega amp fuse can have some arcing across it that can cause that. Well, I pulled it out. Basically, you just take this cover off and you, with it all disconnected, and then you take these bolts or these nuts off and you can pull this fuse out. And if there's any blackening across that, you can replace the fuse for $5. Well, mine was fine. So I just scrubbed them all up with this wire brush, make sure there was no bad connections. So I did all those. And then, um, if you notice right here, the negative leads down first right to the battery. So if you can get that spot right in there. Okay, so I took this off and I took the wire brush to all of this. I still don't think that was my problem though. I think the problem was in this grounding strap right over here. If you'll notice there's a grounding strap going in this, and this is in the 07 and later I believe. GMC's this grounding strap that goes from the body down to the engine. So if you think the the negative is going through the engine because that's where the major uh, lead was going into, and then into the body to provide ground to the rest of the body. Well, this strap, after I really started looking at it, was getting bad down there. But because it was so hard to uh, get to behind the engine. There's just no room and maybe use a crow's foot or something to get to it But I couldn't get to it uh, At least easily I went ahead and just ran a new lead and I went down to Pep Boys and for six bucks I got this negative lead basically that I Strapped on here I clean them all up with a wire brush and then went from the body here to the engine And this was the closest good connector I could find um, and put it on there, haven't had a lick of problem since. So you might wanna try that.